Hey everyone, what's going on? So here it is, another Rough It Talk. So today's Friday, happy Friday to all of you guys. And today I wanna to talk to you guys about something that is very common, everybody hears this, everybody says this, and so it is called time. Most people say they can't work out because they're too busy, they have no time, they're raising a family, they're working hard, blah, 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 blah. That's all I hear after a couple of minutes after talking to my clients and they start talking about time and blaming the fact that they're too busy and they have no time. So I'm a numbers guy. For all of you guys that know me know very well that I will always figure things out. And I'm sitting here at my desk thinking, all right, let's, let's figure out hours real quick. So there are... 24 hours a day and there is seven days a week. So 24 hours a day, seven days a week, that's 168 hours a week times 52 weeks is 8,736 hours. That's crazy, isn't it? The average person trains between two to three times per week. That's the average person. Some people are only training once a week. Some people are only training, some people are training five times a week. All right, but let's go with the average person. So the average person is training between two to three times a week. Let's say three. Three hours per week yet you have 168 hours per week three times a week it's 100 times 52 is 156 hours a year yet you have 8732 hours per year so out of those 8736 i'm sorry 8736 hours you only train in 156 hours per year now, I'm not saying this to tell you that you're supposed to be out there training every day, eight hours a day. I mean, unless you're training for the Olympics, then you should. But for the average person that just looking, is just looking to lose weight, obviously, you know, the three to four times a week will work very nicely if you commit to it. The excuse, I have no time, now you realize it's nothing but an excuse. It's an excuse, all right? So we all have time. The time is there. You just got to find it, all right? You either need to get up early in the morning, maybe a half an hour earlier, 45 minutes earlier, or maybe go to sleep an extra 30 minutes later. Stop watching one of the TV shows. Stop watching other people. I, I call it all the time. I'm not going to watch other people live their lives. I'm going to live mine, all right? So most of us, and I'm not going to say most of us, because I don't do that. If I watch one or two TV shows per week, that's enough, all right? I'd rather much read and do all the things that are important to me. But a lot of people, and in America, it is said that the average person watches about 20 to 30 hours per week of television. So imagine if you use those hours to, into something else, working out, learning another language, reading something that will empower you, you will be much better, all right? But let's go back to the fitness world. So please, Next time that you guys are going to say that you're too busy, you have no time, and the family and the kids and, the, and everything, all the excuses that, you, that you're giving everyone, your coaches, your family, your friends, your loved ones, just know one thing. You are, and please don't get offended, but you are full of shit, and you know it, and we know it. So please, guys, if it's important to you, which it should be, if your health is important to you, please make the time, because if it's not, you are, you're going to continue making the excuses. All right, it is Friday. You guys are gonna go out there, have a great time, and you should. Most people work very hard all week long, so it's time to relax and enjoy your family, obviously. But somewhere between now and Monday, which is about 48 hours from now, you have to make a point to train between one to two hours, all right, in, during the weekend. If you do that, you guys, please remember one thing you're doing the right thing for yourselves, for your health, and just remember. It might help you live a little bit longer so you can continue doing the things that you love. All right? So have a great weekend. Enjoy you guys and uh, have a great time. We'll talk to you guys soon. Take care.